Today, I'm going to make yet another video on charms. I want to cover if you want to look at what an actual charm looks like in-game on your actual skin and check every single pattern, we're going to be going over that. And I'm going to be going over a thread by Tea with Milk and Sugar who made a bunch of just the past sale history of all of these charms, which one's worth more, exactly what it's worth, the difference between like a 90k and a 98k. Let's get into it. This video is sponsored by Skins Monkey. If you've been looking to trade out your old boring skins for new ones, Skins Monkey is the place. By clicking the link in the description, you'll get a 35% deposit bonus when depositing with cash and crypto, and up to a free $5 bonus on your first trade. So be sure to click that link. Skins Monkey also has the freebies tab where they run 24-7 giveaways that are completely free to join with crazy skins. And if you're looking to actually get your hands on some good skins, Skins Monkey is the quickest way to do it. So be sure to get that free $5 and 35% deposit bonus now, trading your CSGO skins with that link at the top of the description. But for starters, let me actually show you guys charms and how to actually inspect different pattern IDs in game. This AK, Diecast AK is a very popular one, I guess. We'll do a pattern 100,000 and this site, cs2inspects.com slash charm, I will link at the top of the description. So this site is very helpful because not only does it show you the actual charm before you even have to inspect it in game, but when you click generate, it will generate this, which here, I'll actually show you guys. Let me show you guys this first actually. So this bottom link, if you just copy it, open up your CSGO or CS2 and paste it in your console, it will then show you what the charm actually looks like in uh, inspect, pattern ID 100,000 looks very cool, but we could also see what it would look like on your actual weapon. If we just copy this, you have to go in the CS2 inspect server that is also on the website, and it is a Discord server, which I will link in the description as well. I cannot put a charm on my knife, but I can put it on my AK. So yeah, then you get to see what it actually looks like in game. So if you want to spend 10 grand on a charm or something crazy, then uh, you could actually see what it looks like here. And it's it's very cool. That's a good spot for a charm. But yeah, it's pretty straightforward. Join their Discord. Link's at the top of the description if you want to do that as well. And uh, yeah, it'll bring you to the Inspect server where you could join. They got NA servers, EU servers. I think they have Asian servers as well. But yeah, that's the first part of this video. Second part of this video is uh, the actual rare patterns that I want to go over. So I'll skip the semi-precious, but well, I'll cover it a little bit. As you guys could see here, the difference between like a 98k, these are actual sales by the way. He has current listings and sales in two separate spots. These are sales. The difference between some 99ks, 98ks, that's like a $30 difference between the two. And then right up next to $100,000, or 100,000 uh, pattern ID rather, can get you uh, almost double the price of like a 99k. So if you have a super, super high tier pattern, take that into consideration because these are actual sales. And same goes with the opposite direction as well. A 6K, a 4.2K pattern ID could get you 70 bucks for this uh, emerald pattern, but way closer to one could get you all the way up to $243 currently. And well, a lot of you guys might have these charms and they might finally be starting to be tradable. I They probably aren't gonna be the same price in a couple of days. So I would more so use this as, oh, I have a 109 pattern emerald. And then look at the price of like a 6K or like sub 10K and see what they're selling at and be like, oh, these have sold for about like three and a half times as much as like the 6k patterns. Even if there isn't any of these listed, you know what they've sold for relative to other patterns. Now, another really cool charm and the one people are most interested in is probably this diecast AK because there's so many different colorways of it, so many different sales and crazy stuff like that. And of course, sales do kind of bounce around a lot. As you can see, just these are only like a hundred apart and nearly double in price. And same goes with this, but the max red patterns are around like 21.5 to 22.5 I believe so those are typically going to sell for a lot more especially the ones just around 22k so there is some really cool patterns here and a lot of them do sell for massive overpay he also gives guides on what buffs uh actual templates are let me show you guys that as well this is just buff 163 I've gone over this site a million times these AKs have dipped down pretty hard in price if it wants to load only 583 I remember they were $14 just like a day ago but you could check the actual gold templates they're selling for way more you could check the blue ones I'm sure they're selling for way more as well little bit the way buff classifies these isn't the best because I mean I would focus way more on the pattern if you have something once again closer to you know here blue starts at 83k so if it's like near 83k it won't get massive overpay but if it's closer to 100k it will get way more overpay as we could see by the sales and just judging this by the actual pattern id you could get way more money 
Tea with Milk and Sugar did this for a whole bunch of charms, and he actually got requested to do even some more in the comments. So even even if you guys have something like a baby carrot tea, they're only eighty four uh, dollars for like seventy five k to eighty k, but three fifty plus for uh, ninety nine k or higher. And there's been recent sales. Let me look at those as well. Hundred, there's like you're getting decent overpay for just like a twenty k pattern difference, and you guys might not even realize that. So even though we well, I said about to say we as Americans, not all of you guys are Americans, but anybody that isn't in China uh, cannot sell on buff. So Americans, Europeans, anybody that isn't in China, you can't sell on buff. But you can use this for, uh, you know, if you want to sell it on the steam market for extra money, how much should you list it for? And if you want to get actual cash for it, like CS float, this will give you a good basis on the, if you should list it for more, how much more. And if you have super rare patterns like 99Ks, 99 point eight K is way closer to a hundred thousand. You should be getting a lot more money for it. So I will be linking this Twitter thread, this website, and uh, what else? And I guess buff at the top of the description as well if you guys wanna check that out. They are super helpful. You can see the actual charms in game as well if you just want to do that. And of course, check out Skins Monkey with that link at the top of the description. Get your free $5 bonus, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.